Good evening. Good evening. I didn't start vlogging earlier because really there was nothing to show. But I'm at the market now getting some groceries so we can cook. Well, I can cook. I always say we and it's just me. That's all of them? Yeah. Oh, okay. I need some of those too. What? Those blue ones up there? Uh, I don't know. Like four. Y'all see I got this big dude with me. I gotta have him when I get these because I can't lift them. But yeah, so we at the market and I think I'm gonna make some Kool-Aid pies for y'all today. Kool-Aid pies, some quick desserts, quick and easy desserts. Show y'all how to make it. And next, I think I'm gonna do some homemade Rice Krispie treats. He used to like homemade Rice Krispie treats. I don't know if he still like them. Cause one time we ate them y'all and I don't know if it was the good butter or what. Our stomach couldn't take it. <laughs> well, we still ate them though. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, you think we gonna make a chocolate one? Okay. You wanna try to make a chocolate pie? I guess so. Well, you ain't gonna help me, is you? I mean, I can help you pick the right one. Pick the right one, but you ain't gonna help me take. You ain't gonna help me make it. I'll be tasting. <laughs> you just gonna help me taste it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what you think we should try some? Hershey's, Nestle, Nesquik, or what? Hershey. Dessert freezers. And you don't get no pie. I wonder what they use. Okay, we do need this. Or I don't know if I want to get the other cool whip. Oh, I'm gonna get this for the Kool-Aid pie. You gonna get this? Extra creamy. The extra creamy one is thicker than the original one. It's better than this one for the Kool-Aid pie. They got all kind of light something else up here. I don't know how many I'm gonna make. I think I'm gonna make two. We don't need no fruit in it. Cause it just takes Kool-Aid. Oh, we gotta get sweet and condensed milk. Whipped cream. And Kool-Aid packets. And I think we passed the Kool-Aid packets too. I don't know, we might not. I'll be back. Kroger got all the White Castle stuff. I got some bikes. They don't got no, they did have the chicken rings last time. The sliders, I'm pretty sure y'all knew about. Chicken breasts. Hmm. Well. No white castles for you. <laughs> no white castles. He wants some chickens, chicken rings. They don't got none of these. I would tell y'all a secret, but I don't think y'all can handle it. So I ain't gonna tell y'all. I'll be back. Okay, guys. I forgot about the Rice Krispies, so we got some Jet Puffs. Marshmallows. I gotta get some real butter because this ain't gonna do it. We need real butter. Oh, Y'all seen the whipped cream already. Now we're gonna get some pie crust for the pies. Ooh, they got pecan pie crust. Ooh, disgusting. 
<laughs> we gonna get this one for the chocolate pie. Well, I don't know why I keep saying we, cause he said he ain't finna help me. Rude. Uh, <laughs> what else? Oh, that's chocolate. Oh no, that's that's some Kroger brand chocolate. That ain't that ain't even Oreos. Look at the color difference. That's just some. I don't even know what. No. We ain't gonna get that. We just gonna get the Oreo crust. And then a regular graham cracker crust. Oh, we need two of those. Dang it, one of these too big. Where's the regular size? Oh, the next bit. Okay, there we go. Two good Keebler graham cracker crusts. And we need to go get another Cool Whip because chocolate. Oh, let me show y'all what we got for the Rice Krispies. We got some. They don't want to focus. There we go. Some Magic Unicorn Shell. And we got some Chocolate Shell. I want to focus. There you go. But that can also go on the chocolate pack. That chocolate shell. Okay, y'all. We gonna come back when I get to the house. I forget, y'all. We gotta get some sweet and condensed milk. I also need some pet milk. Evaporated milk. That's not it, I don't think. No. That, I need some of that though. I think that's what I need. Is evaporated milk? Pet milk? I don't even know. I'ma get it. Okay, this is what we need. It ain't even focusing. Let me set it down. Focus. There you go. Sweetened condensed milk. And you need the 14 ounce can. Bam. We need two, three of these. One, two. That got a dent in it. We don't want that. Tree. One, two, three. Okay, we gotta go get another Cool Whip before I forget. Cause you know my man get real quick. After that, I think we done in the market for today. He don't wanna go to Walmart with me. We could have went to Walmart too. He don't wanna go. So, I go tomorrow, huh? No, I'm gonna go tomorrow anyway cause I ain't gonna feel like it today. So he said, yeah, so y'all gonna see. If you go tomorrow, yeah, he just said that. We gonna see if he really go. He one of them stay on your game all day type of people. So we gonna see. All right, I wanna see y'all probably when I get back to the house. Bye. You ain't trying it? Why wouldn't you try it and you said it's probably good? Y'all ever seen this ice cream called Fat Boy? I might try some. I ain't never seen this before. Fat Boy. Okay guys. I'm back. From the store. And for all these groceries. No, it ain't a whole lot. I just got the stuff I needed for the desserts I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make some quick and easy desserts for you guys. Kool-Aid pies, two Kool-Aid pies and one chocolate pie. I don't know what to call it besides a chocolate pie. I don't know what to call it, uh, whether I wanna call it a chocolate cream pie or Oreo pie. Let me turn this pan off because we're not cooking so you guys can hear me. But yeah, we're making two Kool-Aid pies and one chocolate pie. We're just gonna call it a chocolate pie because I don't know what to call 
It's gonna be a chocolate pie with Oreo crust. But yeah, that's what we're making. I'm not gonna make you guys watch me put up these groceries because I'm pretty sure you saw everything I got. I'm pretty sure you guys saw everything I got except juice. This is the juice I get because it's low in calories and it's very good. Like there's literally, can y'all see it? Five calories in every serving with seven servings, which means there's only 35 calories in the whole bottle. So yeah, that's what we drink. Let me show y'all what else I got. Y'all can't see me, my head cut off, but let me show y'all. I ordered this the other day, and I think it was, I want to say $10, no more than $15. And I think it was $10, though. Because y'all know I be chefing it up. Two in a pack. <laughs> yeah, y'all see it. Y'all see me? Y'all see it? Yes, honey, yes. Cause we needed this. Okay. Let me tighten it a little bit. Yes, baby. We needed us one of these. Let me tie it all the way. Tie it up. Okay, cause I'm something like, something like, I'm something like a chef, you hear me? I'm something like a chef. Y'all see me? What? That girl got her a, a apron? It's official. It's official. Chef, Lady Libra. Haha. <laughs> yes. And I got two for the price that I paid. I'm going to keep this on just because I want to wear it. <laughs> put that other one over there. Okay, I'm going to put up these groceries. I'm probably going to speed this part up because y'all didn't see all this stuff anyway. Okay, so these are the type of pies we're about to make. A mango pie, which mango is my favorite. Mango is literally my favorite pie. And the tropical punch, which is one of my family favorites. They like the tropical punch, I like the mango. And then we're gonna make, of course, the chocolate pie. Which is going to be an experiment, you guys. This chocolate pie is an experiment. So if it don't come out right, don't, don't, don't judge me. Okay. We experiment. Don't judge me. Okay. I'm gonna put this away. Let's wash our hands and get started. Hands are 
Let's get some bowls. Hopefully it won't spill. We'll see. Okay. I'm gonna readjust you guys so you can see. Okay. Let's rinse all these out. Okay. Get those all rinsed out. And we're gonna try to make all three of these at the same time. Let me put this one in front because. It's a little shorter than these up three. And we're gonna start with our sweetened condensed milk. We're gonna add that in each bowl. Let me rinse these off. And if y'all wondering why I rinsed them, I don't know. I'm I'm real big on rinsing the top of my cans before I open them. have to I don't know about y'all but I gotta rinse those hands before I open them and use them Pour, pour, pour. Y'all can't see the other one. So that's that. We got one. Can y'all see that? Two. And the third bowl. Let me see. Let me back it up a little bit so y'all can see. Okay. So now we're going to add our Kool-Aid packs. Let me see how much this is. Because this will help me. 0.14 ounces. That ain't gonna help me. Y'all, that ain't gonna help me. And this is the mango. The tropical punch. those look like that's the mango this is what the tropical punch looks like and this one is gonna be the chocolate now this like I said is an experiment so we don't know how much to put in here or nothing. It's an experiment. It's gonna be chocolatey. <laughs> we need a lot. I don't know. A lot. Okay, let's grab spoons. And yes, we're gonna mess up three spoons because we don't want to mix the flavors. Okay, let's stir it.
that's our chocolate pie. Well, not the pie yet, but the filling, the starting of the filling. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Mango. Can you guys see that? It's literally getting the same color as the bowl. Okay, last but not least, the tropical punch. I don't know why my camera stopped recording, but I ain't asked to do that. Anyway, okay, we have all our fillings. Get out the way. Mixed up. Now we're gonna add our Cool Whip. And we have eight ounces of Cool Whip. Anyway, I don't know if that the eight ounce cool whip uh i forgot to show y'all the 14 ounce i think i told y'all when i was at the store 14 ounces of sweetened condensed milk the cool whip just goes right in blow it okay and you want to let your cool whip sit that's why I have them just sitting there because when you get these they're in the freezer and you want them to be soft so that you can fold it in and not have to blend them or mix them but just fold okay we can set that over there yep yeah, that's nice and soft so it'll mix well Let's open our next one. I want to start off with the chocolates just to see how it's going to turn out because the chocolate part seems kind of runny or watery shall I say so let's see
let's open our pie crust. Okay. That's probably good enough. Let's add it into our Oreo crust. Ooh, that crust is dark. Babe, ooh, almost spilled it on the floor, y'all. Almost spilled it. Okay, we can't use it all. <laughs> it's gonna overflow the crust. Yeah, I don't know how that's going to turn out, but it will get eaten. So I put the top on that, put the top on that, and it will go into the freezer. Oh, it's spilling. Not spilling, but it's definitely overflowing the crust. All right, for our Kool-Aid pies. Okay, we'll do the mango first. Okay, that's the mango. Gonna put it into the crust. Get rid of that. Smooth it around. As you guys can see, it's still very thick, which it should be. That's why I said the chocolate didn't come out <laughs> too well, but that's okay. We'll perfect it one day. We're going to keep trying to make a chocolate one. It tastes pretty good, but the texture was off. The texture was very much so off. As you guys can see how thick and fluffy this one is. This is the mango. Alright, that's done. 
That's the mango Kool-Aid pie. my arms we're gonna go ahead and put it into the crust okay let's see we have our crust I'm gonna put our filling in This one came out perfect also which I knew they would because these are the ones I normally make traditional or not traditional because these are fairly new but this is the Kool-Aid pie that other one I made up <laughs> the chocolate pie was something I made up just because I wanted to try it Okay, we want to smooth it all around, all the way to the edges of the crust, and we don't really try to make no fancy design, just swirl it around and leave it be. Alright, that's our tropical pie, oh, it almost slid right out of there, tropical punch, Kool-Aid pie. All right, you guys, we are done. That's our quick and easy desserts. Quick, simple, and easy desserts. You can make for any time, any occasion, and you can have your children help you. It's very easy, very simple. There's no baking, no major, like, dangerous utensils needed. The finished product. That's the mango, and that's the tropical punch. Oh, I'm now. Oh. 
okay you guys so that's it those pies are ready to go in the freezer and set for a couple of hours and i'll come back and show you guys the slices and how they turn out and i'll see you guys in the next video which we'll be making another quick and easy dessert that the kids can help you make so thanks for watching you guys make sure you like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can see when i post the next video and leave a comment below let me know what you guys want to see me make or cook next all right you guys see ya